Hello Internet! In this video, it's going to be a quick video, we are going to plot a correlation using Python. And we're also going to be using NumPy as well. Add a bit of pandas in there as well. Uh, so, uh, if you have already got your own data set that you want to correlate, fine, this will work fine for you. Uh, if you don't, see the link in the doobly-doo for the data set I'm going to be using, which is this memes data set. Uh, it's just a comma separated list, two variables, memes, dankness, and we're going to correlate them using Python. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. So, first thing we need to do is import some modules. The first one is called NumPy. We import NumPy as MP, that's just sort of idiomatic Python there, and pandas as PD. We're going to use that to import our CSV file. And to plot everything, we're going to import matplotlib.pyplot as plt. Again, more idiomatic Python that we import those modules as something so that we don't have to type the whole thing out every time we want to reference it. So now let's get our data uh, from our CSV file. So for me, that is going to be data pd.readcsv and then we'll pass in our file which is in the same directory I'm currently in so that's fine that's going to work get the x value uh, just for easy reference later on that is data and memes with a capital M for my data set because I put a capital in there I didn't have to do that I just did for fun for shits and giggles and then we're also going to get the y value which in this case is going to be dankness oh Okay, right, so now we need to actually do the correlation. So we've got the data, that's in there, let's now correlate it. And the way we can do that is we can use NumPy again, and we can do this function, which will give us, uh, I think, a Pearson correlation, like that. And then we can start plotting stuff, which is really simple. So we can say plt scatter y, xy, like that. And then we can also just say um, plt.show. All right, so that's just your basics. So if we were to run that now, we will see we have a cheeky little correlation there. And that's okay. Um, there's a few things that we need to sort of see. So we can see there's clearly a positive correlation here between memes and dankness. But how would anyone else know that? Well, we need to put a title on here. We need to put some X labels and a Y label. And then we probably also could put in a line of best fit. And luckily, that's really, 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 really simple. So uh, let's go ahead and do that now. So in order to do a title, we can just say plt.title and give it a title. So that's going to be a plot to show the correlation between memes and whoopsie daisy and dankness like that um, to put an x label we can do plt.x label and say what our x label is like that and then y label same sort of thing just put a y there instead of an x who would have thought like that there we go and now the line of best fit now this is something slightly more complicated but we can do plt dot plot uh, and then we want to get the unique so pass in the unique from x and then we can use this function called poly1d that's useful for polynomials okay and then with inside that we are going to have um, mp polyfit of x y and one and then we also want to do we need a comma there i don't know do we need a comma there no we don't We'll try it this way, mp unique, like this, x, comma, and then we also want to pass in a color so it's distinct and not blue, so we can say, I don't know, yellow. Um, and that, save that, should be us all golden. Ah, oh, I've done something completely wrong, as usual. I can't have one of my videos without something going completely tits up. Oh, that should, why have I put plot? This should actually say um, poly. I even said poly, and I don't know why I decided that I would put plot. Have I put plot anywhere else? Oh, I put plot fit. Yeah. Oh my god, what have I just done? 
What the hell did I just do? That was some weirdness. Block for, oh my god, I've typed it again. Uh, yep, blocks all right. Let's try that now. Oh, look at that! And it has plotted the thing correctly. We have a line of best fits that you can barely see because it's yellow and I haven't made it very good. Um, and we have memes down the bottom, dankness across the top side. There is a correlation between memes and dankness, who knew? Um, so yes, so that has been the video. It's been a very, very short one. I've been very, very quick. Um, going to be doing some more videos on Python with statistics, so check the playlist for more of those and also check the website because there'll be more of those posted on there. If you have any questions, comments as usual, put them down below. I try and answer all of them. And uh, thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye.